What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of my Tottenham career mode. In this episode we have got the first game of the Europa League. We are going up against... and I, is that Zolte Wergum? Looks like we're going to be playing those this episode and it looks as if I'm about to play a weekend team because it's only a few days after the previous league game which was against Sunderland which we came out 2-0 wins. Let's see, I'll look at the squad and see what we can do with it. Everyone seems fully fit, though I'm, I'm going to rest Chadley for this game and bring on Townsend. And also I'm going to bring Bonnie in for Harry Kane to start the game alongside Dumbier. They both got a goal last game against Sunderland and they both deserve to start. So keep the defence as it is. Alright, first game of the Europa League. See if we can start off with a win. By looking at my group, I definitely think you know, I should be winning. I think Locomotive are probably going to be my toughest opponents. Though Salzburg are quite good themselves. Playing at home in the first game obviously gives us a bit of an advantage, but never take anything like that for granted. It can also mean bad things can happen. <laughs> but let's go. Okay, we've got a tough draw here. They even have the Europa League coloured things at the top there. That's quite, that's quite cool. Play it over to Townsend. He's playing on the left, which is ideal with his right foot. Let's play it over for Wilfred Bonney. Win that. Oh, what a start! What a start to the game this is. I'm 1 0 up inside three minutes. Look at that for a ball from Zach Davis and then Bonney winning the header. Bonney and Dumbier in the air. I never thought to do that against Sunderland. But what a start to this game. It is a bullet header. In fact, because of the top of his head, the keeper is not reaching that within a month of Sundays. And what a start to this game that was. Alright then. Three minutes in, 1-0 up. Let's get some more goals. There, please. Now play a ball. Oh, referee, that's a red card. That is a red card, and it is a red card as well. Get off, you dirty motherfucker. That was a very dirty challenge. I don't care what anyone says. That was Noy. Look at that. How bad is, is that tackle? He deserves to be off the pitch for that. Okay, let's whip this one in with Davis. It's a good one, you know? Oh, what the, what? oh I, I don't press shoot. I went to pass it then. No, it is a corner, so... Ericsson. Davis. Oh my god, he almost scored. <laughs> wow. That was a good save from the keeper, that was. And I whacked my knee on my table. On my chair. Yeah. It's ball for choice here. It's Chadley. Oh, what a. How have you missed? How have you missed that? You had the, not just a bit of the goal, you had the entire goal. No keeper. Okay. Wilfred Bonney, Harry Kane. <laughs> Lennon. How, how did he miss? Great work from Chadley and he missed an open goal. Huh? Oh, thank God for that. Nice little 1 0 win there. I don't know how it didn't end more. I win by more. Somehow it ended 1 0. But that is it, really. Good start to the Europa League. Definitely a mixed game there for Wilfred Bonney. Was it him that scored the uh, first goal? It was Wilfred Bonney that scored the first one, but he missed that glorious chance. Open goal. First pass from Chadley. I mean, oh, I don't know how we could ask for more, but somehow we didn't come out with a uh, win by a larger margin. Oh, that's a win by larger margin. That's a, that's a mouthful. And we have a cup game against Middlesbrough coming up. Now, obviously, you guys know my little policy on uh, cup games. In fact, you're going to see me now make a uh, whole new squad. In fact, let's have a look at the things first. Uh, he's handled he can in Spain. So let's just send him to... For a bit of fun. Russia. No, emails. I want to check my emails. Carl Norton wants to play in the next game. Okay, Soldado's unhappy. Well, screw you, mate. You're crap. Sorry, I'm just saying the obvious. Okay, team sheets. We're going to create 
a new team sheet. sheet. I'm going to call it Cup. And for a start, it's going to be Soldado, Harry Kane. It's going to be Mason there. Friedel, no, Vormingal. Uh, Dyer and Kirikesh. On the right is going to be Carl Norton. On the left is going to be Danny Rose in this case. Obviously, they will change every now and again. On the left, we will stick with Townsend. On the right, we will go with Lennon. Ericsson will come out. We'll bring on... Uh, Le we'll, we'll keep Lamella in the team, but uh, Cam. Maybe he'll do better there. I'm pretty happy with that team. That is the team we're going to be playing in the cup games. Unless, of course, someone is injured. But obviously, we do prefer the first team. So, home game against Middlesbrough. We should win this game, really, shouldn't we? No reason why we shouldn't. So, let's see how we go. Right, Fazio's got a yellow card in the first minute. Brilliant. Okay, they've got a yellow card. And we're 1-0 up. Townsend, you actually did something for once. Kane has come on for Dumbia. Wait, oh, I forgot. Oh, I didn't start him. Damn. Oh, I, st I didn't change the team. <laughs> I went with my first team instead of my... Oops. Okay. Oh, now I've got Arsenal. English League Cup. I forgot to change the team to the Cup team. Oh my god, how, how noob... How, why am I so bad at this? Arsenal entertained Manchester City. Then the press conference. Manchester We're away. And I guarantee my team is going to be on... It's not going to be fit. They are not going to be fit for this game, are they? They're going to... Please be fit, please be fit. Oh, wow, they are. I think I might play some of the reserves, though, just to keep them happy. So I will play I will play Rose, and I will play Norton. In fact, I'll even play Kirikesh. Uh, I'm going to drop Townsend. And play Chadley. And I'm also going to play Harry Kane, actually, instead of... Mm, Dumbia. Manchester United. It's hard to pick between Bonnie and Dumbia. <laughs> the drop. And they are both so good. But away game at Arsenal. Now this is a way to get yourself known. Win your derby. And this is a derby for the ages. And I've changed three of the back four. Gonna be interesting. Wolfram Bonnie's on the run here. Go inside. Let's give it to Ericsson. See what he can do with it. Let's go ball out to Lamella. Go ball at the top. It's a little bit too long for Bonnie, but that is definitely what we could do today, particularly with the pace. I think it's that Debushi. He's playing at centre back. No, there's Debushi on the right. This could be Kashel. Yeah, I think that's Kashelny and Murtasaka. I didn't actually see the team. He's playing. Oh my god, he shot from there? He almost scored as well. Okay. Definitely playing a bit of possession football here, Arsenal. Get it? Oh my god, that's Wilshire. No. That's a good chance now to cross. Oh, that's a good ball. That's a very good ball from Sanchez. And I just about managed to clear it. He has so got him. It's Ericsson. Oh my god, how is that not a penalty? He's injured as well. He's injured. Is that Chadley? Yep, it's Chadley, alright. He's injured. Bring on Lennon. No, I don't, I don't want instant replay. Well, there's some etiquette to be observed here at the drop ball. So that's our first injury of the series. God. Okay, come on. Oh my god, I can do this. Go, Lennon. You've got the pace. I need your pace. Cross here. Get there! Oh, I should have won it. Oh my god, what a save from Chesney. Oh no. Now they're on the counter. Now they're on the counter. I have to get... I cannot... I will take a draw. I will take a draw. I will definitely take a draw over defeat. Right, I got the draw. I almost won it right at the end there. That was insane. 
Bonnie almost won it for us after a great run from Lennon and great ball from Ericsson. Based on the stats, we should have won. But I'll give it to Arsenal. They defended really well. I should have definitely tried to get around Mert Sakamore. But things happen. Sometimes you can't control it. Right, let's see how everyone else going on. Chelsea won, Man United won. How did QPR do? They drew. They keep, they keep up, they keep up their good start of the season. We are still in ninth after five games. Arsenal nil. We've got two games in three days coming up. That's going to be fun. Everton have reached top of the table after five wins. They're only six games with only one loss. Swansea have a game in hand, which they can go top if they win. Stoke are up there. Wow, this is a weird table. Spurs are that's us are in ninth. Still on a goal difference of zero. Have we only scored five goals? That is poor in five games, really. We've conceded five as well. Three of them were in one, so we've conceded two goals in four games. That's that's pretty good defensive work. Man City are in eleventh. Liverpool in fifteenth. You know the table's looking a bit peculiar at the minute, but we are still doing quite well. We still are only two points, well, four points off fourth, which is not too well. But we do have a game in hand on Man United, which we do have to win. But that is it for this episode, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please do leave me a like. It does help me out a lot. Please leave me a comment and subscribe if you want to see more content on my channel. And I'll see you all in another episode.